Equid Dropshipping Complete Tutorials as a Beginner Hi guys, in this video, I will be talking about Equid right here and how you can start using its services. So basically, what you want to do when you want to create your account is go to equid.com and to sign in with any emailing platform that you're using. So personally, I signed up using Google and now, boom, I'm already here. So my store, my Equid store doesn't really have anything in it just yet, but you can actually um, set up your products here under catalog and you can check out products here categories and gift cards now click on product to add a new product hit on this button right over here and then you can upload images such as you know main image different angles close up and use or styles and you'll have to set up everything before you can list your item like the attributes but before you can actually do that you have to input all of this information first main image different angles close up and use styles the name sku weight description of your product you know add or edit ribbon add product subtitle this is the first step that you'll need to do in order for you to create your first listing i'm not sure if i still have the extension right here but it's a different video by the way you guys you can add in products right here without manually editing it yourself you can actually use an extension called dropify drop shipping it'll actually import different products from different sites but that deserves another video pricing it can be right over here next is the categories let me hit on leave this page now the categories will be set up and then they will categorize all your can you can add in your products within different categories so you can add a root category a sub category so for the root category maybe you're thinking about tech or something or health or wellness or what else skincare and stuff like that and then the subcategory there you're set up another categories like whitening or is it going to be cell phone accessories and stuff like that and there's also a marketing tab right over here which lets you i mean which helps you market your products now once you go to the marketing tab you can see here an overview of the marketing platforms or marketing ways they can actually choose from. You can uh, advertise across Google. You can promote and sell on Facebook. You can convert abandoned cards to sales. You can promote sales with discount coupons. You can offer discounts to encourage purchases. Or you can retain customers with automated emails. You can engage customers with email newsletters. You can get to know your customers with Google Analytics. You can get more detailed insights and reports to do all of this stuff you'll just have to set them up like for example hitting this button right over here advertise across google i'm not sure if you're gonna pay for anything but yes adsense by google is uh, normally you need to pay for for you to get there now let's try and hit on advertise on google so what you want to do is to just enable this hit on enable and then what this does is it connects and sells your products on free channels like you know on shopping websites or when people search keywords of your product or related to your product and it's loading up the Google Smart Shopping. This is where you can advertise your products on YouTube, Gmail, Google search, basically anything about Google. So this is the first step that you'll need to take targeting when you wanna use the Google Ads feature. Where would you like to show your products, categories, story view, and then preview. So you guys, you don't need another platform for you to do this. You don't need to go to Google Ads yourself and then um, arrange the advertisement right there on Google, but you can do it right here on Equid, right on this marketing panel right over here. Um, next, we also have the reports tab. Now the reports tab, reports and analytics, it basically shows you activities on your shop and how much people are buying, how much people are looking onto your shop and stuff like that. Okay, so next is of course we have sales channels. We have the overview of your sales channels. So this is where you see all of the places where you're selling website you can have an overview of your website you can edit your site by clicking this button right over here you can check out the design and then you can edit them you can edit the site appearance you can edit it by clicking this button right here and also the content and the domain name and site address you can change your address by clicking this button right over here and for the SEO settings, you can control how site or how your site interacts with search engines like Google. So you can upgrade your plan before you can start using this uh, service because you know SEO, you actually need someone to do the job, but paying another or paying a praying or upgrading your plan 
is another way to do that you can also check out facebook and instagram you can connect them but you need to upgrade your plan for you to sell on facebook and instagram also in tiktok you need to upgrade before you can actually connect your store to all of these social media platforms okay so this mobile tab just lets you download or just lets you get to know the mobile app of equid so there's also a mobile app where you can actually uh go ahead and start downloading on your phone on your iphone on your google phone and um there are a couple of features they can actually do with their mobile app you can manage your store you can get notified real time you can sell offline as well sell on the go feature built Next is the configuration tab. You can set up the design, the payment, shipping and pickup, settings, apps, and my profile. But of course, before you do anything, you might as well set up your catalog, which I think is the most important part. So to add a new product, hit on add a new product right there. And then you can see here um, what you need to do in order for you to list the product. Make sure that the images are yeah are, are good looking because i think that images define your store so uh, equid you will need to upload your own images unlike for uh, or download your own images so you can see here they have guide for you to actually follow main image different angles close up and use in styles and then once you're done you can move on to the attributes options files shipping and pickup taxes seo related products and the buy now button okay so next is your dashboard right over here so the dashboard gives you an overview of uh, everything in your store in your shop but if your account is new you'll see this to-do list right here which is basically a guide of the things that you'll need to do for you to use equid fully so creating an account is done you need to set up your web website and storefront next so next thing that you'll need to do is to add your products or services those two are really imperative next is to review regional settings why because you know this is so you can sell to other countries as well next is choose how to deliver your goods next is set up payment options so there are a lot of payment options for your customers to choose from you guys and it's just up to you what you want to choose or maybe offer something that is most convenient for your customer all right so guys that's basically equid and its features you can go ahead and try it for yourself and let me know what you think down in comments below but that's it for this video i'll see you again on the next one peace out